You know what? I love the white picket fences like that, even though that's not wood anymore. That, nobody makes them out of wood. They're, that's all ABS plastic or something. But I love fences like that. Love them. Do I dare look in his box and his... Nothing. Okay. I think there's some trash sitting around, but... Trouble with digging in bags like this is you got to make sure you can close them back up and not make a mess. Now, if it's bags like in a dumpster, don't matter. But like this, and most time these people's got them tied up tight. Now if it's clear bags like that kind of is there and I see cans, I will make an effort to get them. Um, this is why I need to get with all these neighbors. That's fabric, whatever it is. That ain't gonna work. Well, is anything? Nope, something done tore into that bag down there, but I don't see no signs of no. No cans. There's a bunch of egrets. Cattle egrets. Eating the bugs, boys. Them. I don't know what that is, but I don't think it's anything I want. Well, you know, somebody made the comment the other day. Said, you used to cuss, and I don't hear you cussing anymore. I said, well... Occasionally, I'll, something will upset me or something, and I'll start cussing. But for the most part, I try not to do it. It's just really stupid. I mean, cussing don't get you nothing. If anything, it's going to make people kind of proud that you're doing that. So why do it? But every once in a while, I'll slip up. I'll, well, I'll let a bunch spew out the other day. Uh-oh. And it was my phone. This, I, I cannot, this phone is so hard for me to offer. It's one of them Eric Dagon smartphones. And I was talking to somebody, I don't know what it was, and then supposedly nothing in there. Nothing. And uh so we got done talking and I hung up, or I thought I hung up. And a little notice come up. 
ongoing call. Well, I hung up, I thought, and I kept trying to get to it where I could hang it up. And I couldn't get to it, and I started cussing in. That thing makes me so mad. I forget who I was talking to. I hope they didn't hear me cussing. Whoever it was, because I talked to a pastor. It used to be my pastor. I talked to him. It might have been him. And I was talking to my friend of mine who is a retired school teacher. He was he's a scoutmaster. Was well, I don't know if he's still a scoutmaster of that troop or not, but I know he was for years. And it was Donovan's scoutmaster, my grandson, the oldest one. I can't. I hope it won't him, Dad. Gone it. I hope if it was, I hope it. I, they didn't hear me cussing like that. Well, I've got a lot of stuff in this place right here. He's always doing work. Oh, I see a beer, a uh, drink can. I don't know if it's a beer can or not, but we'll. Where'd it go? There it is. Actually, there's two in there. Actually, there's three in there. I'm going to have to crush some cans. Whoops, that might have a little liquid in it. Here's a lamp. batter up. He must have a little kid. Anyhow. Not much. But it's not nothing. Not nothing. <sighs> okay. That guy really does a super job on his yard and I asked him one there some trumpet lines over there I heard them things it's got is poisonous or narcotic or something I don't know I might have to look that up I will look at, you know what when I think of something I want to look up on uh, the internet if I don't jot it down, write it down, I will forget about it. And right now, I don't have nothing to jot down on, so chances are I might one day cross my mind to check on it. But I have to write stuff down now. Especially on the stories I tell and stuff, you know, I think of something I want to tell them, I need to write it down. And I, I've got a long page of stories. Matter of fact, I've got some I would like to tell, but I don't know if it's a good idea to tell. I mean, there's lots of things that you'd rather not discuss that you go through life with. Well, I wonder if that's my friend there with these lights on. Yes, it is. Hey, Daniel. Hey, good morning, man. Guess what I just seen? Sir? I said, guess what I just seen? Somebody's trash can had a big old drone sitting on it before he crashed it. Uh-uh. Did you get it? <laughs> no. What could I do with it? I don't know. Maybe fix it? Camera on it? No, it's pretty well trashed. He crashed it into something. Is, Is this on? Yeah. Yep, but it ain't taking anything. Okay. I just made a 
score. Look at that. Copper. And that's copper. And I'm going to have to... I don't want that falling off. And I just got to pick the rose for me. Of course, it's about gone. But boy, it's got an incredible, incredible smell. That was a good copper score. That was about, it's about five pounds worth. About five pounds worth. Get a little closer look to that. See, when I see these boxes, then I'm thinking there's probably some aluminum cans in there somewhere. But I just don't feel that comfortable. Wait a minute, what is that? Okay, that's a power bar and there'll be a lot of copper in that. Maybe I'm going to find a little stuff today. And as my friend Scrap and Pallet Man would say, thank you, God. And maybe i got to start saying that a little more often. What have we got here? An empty box. Or is there something in that box? What the heck is that? Oh, that's blinds. That's window blinds. I don't. That's 
gonna be better. Now I'm gonna put them in my my bag from the best way to do it. Take this off. I wanna be sure I'll pick them up. a long ways down there. Back when I was younger, it was a lot closer, <laughs> or seemed like. Seemed like. You know, Trash packing. Yeah, I'm gonna give that to my lady friend. That's another piece of that copper I scored my friend just gave me he um he don't want to be on camera giving me this stuff because he's got some other people that knows him that wants him to give it to them And he said he'd rather give it to me. I guess he likes me. I guess he likes me. And now, I'm going to go around to Publix. Snag me a cup of coffee, and I might even get to talk to somebody. Well, I've already talked to some folks this morning. That's good. Big old tree fell over here yesterday. They got it cleaned up, boys. I'm going to go down there and take a peek. But I seen it fell, and I went going over there, and this woman and her husband that does tree work and stuff, they was over there blocking stuff off and getting ready to cut it up. But that's right before I got caught in that daggone rainstorm. See how they did that. Well, what they did with the light bulb. I was going to see if that light bulb had any copper on it. Alright, right there's a tree that, that it fell off of. Right up there it broke off. They got it all hauled off. And there's the 
Oh, I wonder. Is that copper? Boy, it crushed that pole, didn't it? I wonder if that's copper and if it's all right to get, I don't know. I'm going to see anyway. I'm going to see. Oh. Is that copper or steel? That's got to be steel. That can't be copper. Why would they have copper running through the concrete? No, I still. But now that piece laying right there. Huh. I don't want to bust my butt over here, but that piece might be up for grabs. You know what? I'm gonna come over here and get that. I hope I got my cutters in there. I'm gonna come over there. Don't tell me it ain't in here. Yeah, it's in here. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna come back and get that. Yeah, he is. That's right here and bust my butt. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna come over and get that. He's coughing. Hey Tony. Morning. How are you? I'm doing. You doing all right? I'm doing okay. How many more years are you going to stay here? So you get ready to retire, maybe? I don't know. How old are you? 43. 43? I got some. I got a few years left. Yeah, you do that. I wish I had 43. <laughs> Have a good one, buddy. You too. See if they're on sale, and no, they ain't on sale. Probably will be next weekend. So, all I'm gonna get from here today is a cup of coffee. Cup of coffee. I don't like all this stuff going on this morning. Every time something comes up on my email, it pops up. And I ain't interested. Okay. You know what? I just thought of something. Uh, I'm going to get me a cup of coffee. And I'm going to set this right here. Oh, I'm doing it. Yesterday I started pouring my creamer and I thought it was creamer and it was sugar.
there we go. Cut that copper wire out of there. Have a good one. I'm gonna try it, Tony. Yes. You, you have any kids? No. Well, I mean, I have I have nieces and nephews. Oh, okay. But as far as kids, no. Well, that's kind of good but then again it's kind of bad you know i guess it depends on how you feel i've got i've got two i had two my son died in 86 he was 14 but i've got a daughter oh, no. and three grandkids yeah and a bunch of nieces and nephews that i hardly ever see yeah. uh i have uh i have three older siblings and then i have one younger one and the uh, and the three older ones have the uh, uh, have the nieces and nephews. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. Well, you got family then, that's for yes, sure. Yes, sir. All right, my friend. I come from a very blessed family. Really? Yep. That's good. And I and then I and then I also have one great nephew. So. Yeah. yeah. All right, Tony. Did I say? Did I? I did I say something? <laughs> no, you didn't say anything. You just said good morning. Good morning, good morning sir. Good morning. How are you doing? Oh, we're doing okay. You all have a good day? You too. Good mileage. Thank you. Go up here and cut that wire. I want to make dang sure I don't fall getting over there. And cut it. And I'm gonna sip on my coffee a little bit. You know, I expect that tree that that big limb fell off of yesterday, that thing was huge, but that tree, I think it's fixing to fall from the roots because look, can you see how that is? Uh, see how the roots is growing up under the pavement there and they're swelling it up? And the concrete, it's moving that hole. And that tells me that thing is leaning and it's wanting to fall. And that's a big tree. I know it's over 100 years old. It may be 200 years old. But that limb that fell off that thing was up there and it was all down in here. It broke that light pole. And that's where that copper's at that I'm going to try and... that I'm going to try and snag. I don't know how much... Uh, let's see.